Hello everybody, I am Redman19 and welcome to episode number 3 of our United States campaign in Season 2 of Empire Total War as we're working through the epilogue to Season 2. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day, I know I've had a good one and uh, this game is going pretty well actually. Uh, for a good little start, got a lot of money, used all that to really hyper focus on our, uh, you know, our industry and agricultural and things like that, which has really paid dividends so far. I'm making a lot of money. I'm also trading with a ton of guys, um, and thanks that's kind of thanks to Spain attacking us uh, out of the blue, so that worked out for me. But anyways, guys, um, yeah, this is going pretty well. I like this campaign. The United States is always fun. It, it's home. It, it's, you know, for me, it's easy to really play there, considering I know a lot of the geography already. I wish geography played more of a, like a factor into this game, other than like, oh, well, you're... You know, you're in the snow. Oh, it decided to rain in this battle. You know, like you have no choice over all that. I wish you did. But yeah, we're doing pretty well, making quite a bit of money and getting ready to do some interesting things, I feel, by attacking the Cherokee and then hopefully doing some naval uh, invasions throughout the Caribbean. You know, trying to make ourselves super strong. Uh, we're only about 11 turns into the game, so we're not very deep. I mean, technically it's about uh, almost 10, almost 10%, 8, 9, 10%, somewhere in there. For how many turns we have. It's going to be a shorter campaign. There's only like 87 turns or something. Of course, you know, it also comes down to how long the loading, t the wait times are in between turns and how quickly I can get to ward it with some people. There is unused land suitable for plantations in this region. They really want me to bump up Georgia, don't they? The place doesn't make a ton of money. I mean, I get that. Okay. Um, as for this, like, I'm letting it work its way. I mean, two more turns and then we won't even need this building. And I can start doing something else with it. Um, you, I want you here. And then you guys are, can, you know, two turns away from your final place for now. You're working up through this. Um, nothing you could do there. It's here, I think. Yeah, 30%. 100% and 100%, yeah. So then I could use that Protestant Missionary anywhere I wanted to. All right. Um, this place, one more turn, and it can start working its way up. As for what we're doing right now, um, guess the Military Academy is fine. Don't have a preference on that. 3880 on a lot of these. Yeah, there's only really one building I don't want it working up. Can we trade? Oh, we can trade with somebody. Austria, could you potentially want to do something now? Okay, yeah, I'll pay 160 for that. And then... How about... Genoa sounds like a good one. They won't do it. Um... Denmark, uh, I don't really know if I should do anything with them. Morocco doesn't have anything. Mysore, I did say I would try. 330 is worth it for them. They have a bunch of spices and stuff. Persia, Portugal, probably won't do it. Oh, they would that, that time. Okay, good. Well, we're back to making, we're almost making 14,000. Per turn, like now I'm definitely spending money, like getting these armies. Um, speaking of armies, we're looking over here. Let's build one thing, a 12 footer or 12 pounder. Excuse, it's actually two of them. Take a look. We have no, we're going to get regiments, a horse, and then Where is it that I can build? A, yeah, there's the first Delaware. I want those. 
988. Okay, that's fine. I'll transfer them up here to Boston. Or better yet, why don't I bring these guys down? And we'll cancel this and build everybody here. Okay. Yep, there's... Yeah, there it all is. Two artillery, one more howitzer, two horse cab. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. I think we're good. Um, research is going just well. Poland was actually just destroyed. Wow. Split between Prussia, Austria, and it looks like Russia had done something and they lost Minsk. But okay. In the turn. All right. The British are invading France. If France loses their territories in Europe, then they lose their colonies as well, and we're going to want to sweep in and grab them. So keep that in mind. We're building up our army. We might be able to rush in there and grab them, which will make us extremely powerful. Okay, they got beat, though. Yep, all right, good for you, France, for handling the, handing the British a huge blow. They just lost an entire army. So, wishful thinking. All right. We're not ready to end that alliance, though. You know, they are helping us not be attacked by some people. Okay, Ottomans. All right. Portuguese ships. I'd love to trade with Morocco. That'd be funny. I'm creating the major non-NATO allies now. <laughs> okay. That looks good. Sweden looks like they're probably going to head for Christiana and take Norway. And they're also fighting the Russians in Finland. All right. There is unused land suitable for plantations in this region. Osceola. 24-25 on that. Okay. Um, I am going to go ahead and do this up here to get that finalized. Um, you are traveling to here. You are traveling here. I'm going to move. That's five. That would make an army of six. Seven, eight, nine. I'm going to go ahead and shift these up to here, too. And then we'll be building out this. Okay. Um, the sack's going to be actually 14 strong. So we need to... Let's see, we have what? One, two, three, four, five, six... 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. There you go. Pretty large stack. All right. Are you done? Nope. One more. One more turn, then I can turn these guys. Steamship by Great Britain. We don't necessarily care about all that. Nation destroyed Corland. Any more trading? Yeah, no more trading opened up.
Yeah, I'd love it if the United Provinces were to take over French Guyana. That would allow me to come swoop in, swoop in here and get two quick, easy locations. Alright. Let's uh, end this turn. Nothing else to do. Are we going to spend any money? We didn't. Which is fine. I would like to get some walls when I'm ready. But uh, it doesn't look like that's going to be right now. Walls here are good because I could be attacked at any time. And the longer that we have taken and hold these provinces, the natural defense will be higher. Wow, look at France. France is having to repel a little bit. Russia, what are you doing? <laughs> Alright, that looks good. Yeah, that rake's just been out there forever. It looks like they're moving on France, too. Which is fine. I mean, if the Iroquois take it over, it's not so bad. All right. Now, what I want to do before I attack the British is actually have a bit of a navy. Just to kind of be like, you're going to have to really fight to even get your men here. So hopefully I can take the Iroquois without having to really attack, fight the British, and I can focus. I mean, that's probably not going to happen, though. It's not likely. Oh, okay, oh, yep, Russians gone there. Swedes are definitely getting some battle-tested troops. It's 1789 in the game, so... Looking at the year of our uh, there is unused land constitution. For plantations in this region. Built Imokali. And we are going to overrun the sugar and cotton and all that. I can already tell. I mean, he does make good money. And we're making 11,000 right now. And building an army. Can we leave? Absolutely. First rate ship of the line by Great Britain. Of course. Um, Philadelphia gets the House of Representatives. We're going to go ahead and build a presidential palace here. Cost 5825. Ready for order. The quickest way to Chickasaw or Toledo is through here. Now, honestly, I probably want to attack here first and knock out as many troops as I can. Setting up count. So we'll do that. Thirty-four eighty, thirty-four eighty. Um, I'm gonna roll these navy a little closer to the shores down here. Yeah, this is Iroquois now. We're looking for these things to possibly rebel though, because if I have the neighboring territory, I can just swoop in and grab them. Okay. Yes. We'll go here. Can't wait a that. turn. You're up here, getting built up. You have one more turn until those are done. Sir. Sir. You're going there. Make ready. You're going Make there. Ready. I have 9,125 left over. Let's end the turn and see. We spent a little bit. Um. Looks to be about 3400 That may be the cost of walls now. I don't know. Okay. We're still about 10 years away from being able to bump up to 15 units per stack. So for right now, don't worry. You know, we're, we're at about as big as we can be on multiple stacks right now. All right, looks good. Come on, Prussia, there you go. I could take those units from Philadelphia and use them to attack the northern Cherokee territory. 
just to get it taken over quicker. Not the worst idea either. Um, they'll be done and ready to go in this turn. Okay. Of course, I want them in Philadelphia. But I'm not seeing Spain making any aggressive moves. Too aggressive, at least. And the United Promise is just shifting those ships around. They didn't do anything else. Yeah, France could attack. One you know, the Dutch, that'd be great. Under attack from an enemy fleet. Without your intervention, they'll raid all shipping and take any goods and income. Okay, we're going to come down here. I want to grab this guy here. His job is going to be to first come down here and do this for me. Yes, I shall rest a little. You're going to go okay. here. Forward. The quickest way for you to get here is to go here. Okay. These troops appear to be gone. This guy has a mistress now. Trade route we don't care about. That's done. Okay. Public servant Samuel Adams died. Unfortunate. Guess we're gonna just have to suffer for his, you know, for only his beer. Let's see anything else? He's the British, and they're six-rate formidable. Um, I think we're good. It costs thirty-eight eighty. I don't know if that's how much we were spending or not. We could have spent twenty-nine ten. That's exactly what we spent it. Okay. In the turn, let it go. 13127. We definitely built a few of those. At least three. If the game wants to handle that, that's fine. Yep, Cherokee rolling back all into Toleco. Very interesting there. Yeah, the Austrians moving around quite a bit. All right. Oh, okay, there we go. The Ottoman. They seem to just patrol their shores a lot. Though they did lose Ankara. To rebels. That was the Mamluks. I'd be rushing to it. Um, Portugal. Look at that Russian stack on that shit on those ships. Ah, that's not too bad with Spain. As long as they're not bringing over troops, I don't care. Okay. Yep, all that stuff's good. I think we've got all the state capitals and all. I might want to look in like in the future of like switching these out. By getting here, it's not going to make me reach this. Yeah, let me wrap up some stuff, get all the stuff out of there before I start switching out these capitals to something else. Um, this is seventy percent almost. God's will. You're going to here. There you go. That looks great. Just want to see where all he's just did all that stuff at. Alright, he didn't do it in Maryland, but he did it in Philadelphia. 
Didn't do it in Albany. Didn't do it in Boston. Didn't do it in Maine. So, oh, he worked on the settlement fortifications. That's what he did. I see, I see. Okay, um... I'm not making near as much because my... Uh, this port here. What does he have in there? A 6th rate and a 5th rate. Eh, whatever. Send the carronade to here. That place is covered. I can't do anything with that one. It's okay. Okay, Cherokee. Cancel our trade agreement. And then we're going to declare a war. We will not bring in France. There you go. I just want to bring these guys first to here. Any further orders? And then I want to bring you to here. And then the next turn I can just boop, boop. Just like that. Let's end the turn. We want to circle up both towns. And we'll attack the, the top one first. For obvious reasons. Mainly, you know, you don't want your, the capital to move and then it to be even harder on you. Look at that, they just pull their men in. They're like, okay, prepare for the worst. These are not the Americans that we fought before. That's right, we're not. We're much better. We're ready to fight for some frontier here. All right. Mughal. All right. Yep, Ottoman moving back in, okay. I think we can get one attack in today. I might extend the episode just long enough. He definitely just parked those ships off of Stockholm there. And he gave me my trade port back. Thank you. Come on. There is unused land suitable for plantations in this region. Building plantations here will increase your nation's export capacity, improving income through... I don't necessarily like doing that, but I did it anyway. All the way. Awaiting further Fix that up. Ready you forward. to here. Command siege. Siege it. You yes. to here. Rats in a cave. Siege it. And then we're just gonna attack here. Uh it's 1026 with an extra 990 against 978. So uh let's just attack. Okay, we got our men. Here, get these, 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 these. Poke them. Like right here is fine. Yeah, that's about as good as it's gonna get. Um, over here you stop, you go there, we're in a position.
Let's take these down here. Pulling these guys up. So, he's fighting among these. We should knock him out before you know it. Bunch of Lancers here, but we're now firing. Yeah, he's shattered. Shattered. them in position. Yep, armed tribesmen. Okay, you guys should all be right there you go. Fire away. Okay, we're fighting the armed tribesmen here. First battle, so we're not, you know, ranked up or anything like that. Okay. Just take your shots. This warrior society is now shattered. These guys are broken. He's shattered. Let's go ahead and shoot these guys in the back and shatter them too. There you go. Good shooting. Come on, keep going. There they are. They're shattered now. Sit and square. There you go, mow him down. He's down to five now. Oh, we caught all these guys in the middle of their break. Oh no, these guys are just down here. Oh no. <laughs> Unexpected. Okay, that was a chief up there. Fire away, all of you. Let's see if we can quickly end and then save this horse. Race, 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 race. We've ended that. Go there. Go there. Go here. Okay. Shatter. These guys are now, yep, broken. We're hitting them. Yep, keep firing. These are bowmen, musketmen. 
All these guys are now running. Alright, I think we're good. He's shattered. We're waiting on this guy here. Yep, he's shattered. Hit the mess of men, which might be in range of these guys here. He's done. Okay. Alright, end it. There's a good little battle. Um, we killed 978, lost 163 of our own. And there goes Taliko, which we're going to get rid of that. Fix up these men. Get rid of this. Uh, we'll leave that. Get rid of this. Uh, also going to get rid of this. And that's going to make that battle done. Um, not going to have good chances with our, our horse, but we'll just have to kind of waltz into this next battle. Uh, we might get to use theirs a little bit. But, uh... Yeah, alright guys, well I feel like that's all we can do here in this episode. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell, like the video, comment, and check out the link for Discord description below. And guys, I will see you all next time.